fitted with an autopilot little bigger than a coin, this drone can navigate small spaces autonomously, presenting new potentially life-saving options for first responders. Called Lisa S, the autopilot was designed by a team led by Bart Reams at the Micro Aerial Vehicle Lab at Delft University of Technology. This is uh, the smallest open source autopilot in the world. It only weighs two grams and is two by two centimeter. And uh, yeah, it is the lightest open source autopilot in the world. Reams says the autopilot's size and weight greatly expands the capabilities of micro-sized UAVs, allowing them to fly for longer while carrying heavier payloads. Reams' team wrote Lisa S's software from scratch, designing their own Datalink radio receiver. This small piece uh, that's on top of the autopilot is uh, replacing an RC transmitter and a Wi-Fi data link. So now you can connect with this small piece of software hardware to an uh, USB dongle in your PC for the ground station. So you have Google Earth there to uh, uh, say where you have to fly to and to your normal RC transmitter so uh, that you also can take it over or can fly it in normal uh, RC mode. Reams wants the team's work freely accessible to the public so it can be fitted to all types of unmanned quadcopter and mini helicopter, particularly those used in firefighting and search and rescue missions. He thinks micro aircrafts using Lisa S could be fitted with mini video cameras and put in every firefighter's pocket, allowing them to check collapsed buildings for survivors without having to risk their own lives. Lisa S will be available commercially next January, when Reem says he hopes to see them flying off the shelves.